Hey guys, Ash here. This is my video review of the Mid Team 2.2 Ice Cream Sandwich ROM for the Galaxy Note GT N7000. So guys, uh, this ROM is based on the latest stock uh, LRI. That's uh, the Bulgaria release for I mean, August. So uh, pretty recent. And uh, that's Android 4.0.4 ICS. Uh, so guys, uh, the first thing you notice is the ROM is really smooth. Uh, and it's pretty fast and the thing here is uh, what do you say it's almost as smooth as the preview releases of Jelly Bean that we're getting not the buttery feel of Jelly Bean but as smooth as an ICS ROM can get and you've got the basic uh, a few themes borrowed from the S3 like the transitions over here that's touch with UX uh, the uh, weather widget here is touch with UX and a few like that uh, the keyboard has also been, also been uh, you know, is not the standard keyboard. You get a little different one, uh, little changes. Okay, one thing here, guys, is I've not been able to get Play Store to work uh, on its own. Uh, you're recommended to flash the 2.2 update file to get Play Store to work, but I cleared the cache, I cleared the wipe Dalvik, and uh, flashed the update, but I was still not able to get Play Store to work. So, if anyone is facing that issue, all you need to do, if you have a backup with Titanium, what I did was I wiped the data and installed the app with Titanium Backup and then I restored my backup and it worked perfectly for me. So apart from this one minor niggle, I don't find anything uh, negative to say about the ROM. Uh, all ice cream, ice cream sandwich features work. You've got your 15, uh, 15, what do you say, 15 icon toggle. You've got the uh, shortcuts over here and the clear button. Uh, transparent pull down bar so as far as uh, pre-included apps go you get uh, CPU spy ad free air push detector app quarantine uh, and uh, you get beats audio included um, and you also get the Sony Walkman music player so this is a pretty uh, decent player so just to show you quickly pretty decent so and then you get the not call log what uh, once the call is over where you want the dialer to go whether back whether you want the phone to return to the dialer or go back home and so on so that's another nice feature so guys one thing that, uh, that has always bothered me a bit about the mid-team ROMs is that you don't have the inbuilt recording feature like uh, what you see with rocket rom or the others as in when you place a call i don't have a sim here to show you but when you place a call uh, you get a record record button with uh, rocket rom and others but with my team uh, maxi said the developers always favored sanity uh, but the problem that i had that we faced was that sanity uh, is a paid app so you get two minutes of call recording or you have to purchase that but right now my team uh, has included the inbuilt call recording feature so when you call somebody you get the record button over there so that's another, ni another nice feature here a welcome addition to mid team and you also have the awesome beats app uh, you can enable uh, beats boost if, if required via speaker for headset controls and for bluetooth as well so there is a minimal difference when you listen to music uh, nothing it's not too big a difference but so it's nice that uh, we have the option to have it and then again guys with a uh, you have an extended uh, on device options menu then you press and hold power uh, hitting restart will give you options to re reboot hot reboot boot into uh, download mode or recovery directly so these are all uh, what do you say fine little additions to the ROM in my opinion so uh, what else all your all your S Pen features uh, remain. Uh, getting it out. So your touch with features like tapping and holding, taking screenshots, and uh, your S Pen features, the press sensitivity, everything is present. Touch with space from so everything is there. So again, you also get your 4.0.4 additions, like for example, uh, 
going into security the signature unlock is present and it works fine and going back and quickly into my files and uh, video player you get a pop up video player that's sparks and recreation so then uh, the camera app works fine, no issues. Uh, 8 megapixel charts, 1080p video, uh, you get the regular touchless camera, so uh, no issues with anything. One more weird thing that I found was uh, going into wallpapers, uh, wallpaper gallery. Wallpaper gallery seemed empty. Uh, I don't know why. Um, I'm not really sure that's something I thought I'll let you guys know. Uh, Apart from that, Bluetooth works fine, the call, call quality, no issues, uh, Wi-Fi is strong, no Wi-Fi drops, no Bluetooth issues, and uh, no hotspot issues either. Everything works as it should, so that's great. So let me quickly run the benchmarks here, guys, first starting with Quadrant Standard, running a full benchmark. Okay, hitting yes. We're hitting 4,195, which is a very good score for the Galaxy Note. Now, moving on to Antutu benchmark. Test. Start test. So there we have it guys, uh, 6,220 is the score. So as far as battery life goes, it's pretty decent on par with my team ROMs, as always. Uh, I get close to 25 hours with moderate, moderate usage, uh, definitely lasts a full day. Uh, so I don't have the stats to show you guys since I just flashed this ROM over, I was on, I was testing out a different ROM. So uh, overall guys, this ROM is a definite step up from... Uh, what do you say the stock and it's got a lot of uh, extra modifications you've got the s3 transfer transitions and uh, the call record feature uh, the 15 bar toggle and so on everything works as it should perfectly no issues so that's pretty much it guys when it comes to uh, mid team 2.2 review for the galaxy Note gtn 7000 if you guys have any questions leave it in the comment section or you guys can hit me up on Facebook or Twitter or you guys can email me directly all my contact details are in the description uh, so again this is a very good ROM and I highly recommend it so uh, there are not many issues with it apart from the Play Store thing uh, which is easily resolvable so I also have a link to uh, my tutorial for the installation of Mid Team 2.2 uh, in the description so hit that up if you want to check out the installation instructions so that's pretty much it guys uh, before you go make sure you hit the like and subscribe buttons uh, we'll be coming out with more videos for the Galaxy Note DS3 the One X and uh, the Nexus 7 if you guys want to do me a favor if there's anything that you can order online or you want to order online right now use my links to Amazon in the description it does not necessarily have to be smartphone related stuff just go through the link to Amazon uh, use the search box on the page that loads up search for whatever you want purchase it and if you end up placing an order I tend to make a few cents to a few bucks so if you guys can help me it be much appreciated uh, so that's pretty much it guys thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you guys soon bye bye now